As Benedict matches wits with Minister Exam at Castle Woolfort, and Roland risks the wrath of the Archduke at Twinsgate, Frederica embarks on her own mission. Under the false banner of the Consortium, she hides her forces, marching steadily toward the Byzantine Holy State. With the aid of Clarice, she aims to gain entrance into the Source, that she might lead her people from their prison. Meanwhile, in the Rosellen village, Jerome has gathered his people to share the news of Frederica's exploits. Everyone, listen well. We've received a missive from Lady Frederica. It seems House Wolford has made good on their word, and taken the first steps toward a new future for Norzelia. Even now, Lady Frederica marches for the Source, where she intends to free our brothers and sisters from their prison. So bold for one so young. Truly, she is her mother's daughter. In her letter, she outlines the details of her plan. The road ahead of her is trying, but not impossible. However, she warns that failure may incite Hyzant's wrath, and asks that we flee for our own safety. Even now, she has only our best interests at heart. Were this letter to fall into the wrong hands, the results would be grave indeed. She risked much to warn us. What should we do, my lord? Prepare to flee? Yes, at once. But I do not ask all of you to flee. Lady Frederica risks life and limb for us all. I would not let her do so alone. I intend to go to her. Whatever danger she may face, we face it together. You may meet with the full wrath of Hyzant. Are you ready for that? Aye. And I welcome any who are of the same mind to join me. I ask the rest to watch well over those who would stay behind. If we do not return, I ask you to survive. To live. These bones aren't too brittle for another fight. It's time to pay the debt we owe the Wolfords. I'm with you. Norzelia will sing of the courage of the Roselle. We ain't letting you take all the glory, Jerome. You're gonna have to share it around. The village will be in good hands while you're away. We won't let anyone do us harm. Thank you, my friends. Those who would fight, take up your weapons and march. We make for Hyzant at once. Aye! I suspect soon we shall have a bird from Minister Exham bearing good news. It shan't be long before the mines are under our dominion. That's not my worry. I wonder whether the Wallforts will obey. They owe us their lives and more besides. They wouldn't dare scorn all the Hierophant has given them. Even if they have no great love for our nation? Even if they've cast aspersions on our past deeds? I advise you to be cautious with your words. You edge dangerously close to heresy. And not even one of the saintly seven is immune from the goddess's judgment. Of course. My apologies. Pray forget my foolishness. So long as you understand. That being said, the Wolfords have but recently come into their station. And the inexperienced often reach beyond their grasp. Where are you going? To ensure the city is in order. My intuition tells me something wicked stirs within her streets. My long years have attuned me to her pulse, and I can tell when it has quickened.
I'll handle the guards. Don't move a muscle, any of you. Don't even breathe. Hail! I am Claris of the Consortium. I bring goods for trade in the city, if you'll give me leave to pass. Claris! Consortium's working you hard. In these dangerous times, tis a privilege to be in such good employ. But you worked even harder than I. Here, a small token of my appreciation. <laughs> you always have been a thoughtful man. Go on, then. Wait! We cannot allow unscheduled goods into the city without inspection! <sighs> Fine. Guess there's no such thing as being too careful. <sighs> you needn't worry. Minister Kamsel of the Saintly Seven sent for these goods himself. He did? Oh, yes. Look closely, and you'll see. What have you done?! Ah, you snake! I must call for reinforcements! Claris, are you alright? My apologies. Luckily, mine was the only face they saw. Allow me to distract the troops. Use the opportunity to sneak into the source, my lady. Don't forget the explosives we packed away, either. We'd make poor guests without them. You're going alone? You risk too much. Ah, my lady. But you do not become a merchant of my standing without a little risk. Pray save your worry for yourself. I've wagered quite a great deal on your success, after all. And I abhor calculating losses. Thank you, Claris. I promise this arrangement will give cause to celebrate before long.
We've far yet to go, together. This calls for a drink. My fellow Roselle, I am Frederica Esfrost. 
daughter of Orlea, who led you and your forebears from the bonds of servitude 30 years ago. I knew I recognized you from somewhere. You're the spitting image of her. What's Lady Orlea's flesh and blood doing in this goddess-forsaken prison? I am here to free you from it. I would see the end of Hyzant's tyranny alongside my betrothed, Lord of House Wolfort. Rise up and join us. Hyzant wavers even now, and the Rizal can be the gust of wind that topples them from their lofty heights. You speak like her too. Same heartfelt words. But look where those got us. We were lucky enough to be spared our lives once. They won't be so generous a second time. We're still paying for our sins. For thinking the salt of the realm could be ours. The goddess will forgive us. She will. We only need suffer a short while longer. Suffer? No! Don't swallow those lies! Enough! Minister Kamsel! Claris, are you... I'm sorry, my lady. I couldn't get away. He has more resolve than a common merchant has a right to. Better men have broken under lesser interrogations than his. Still, I can always smell a rat. It was only a matter of time before I caught the stench of rebellion. Led by none other than the Lady Frederica. I knew you could not change your nature. Your punishment shall be a lesson to your fellow sinners, just as your mother's once was. I should have known it was futile to resist. Forgive us, Goddess. It wasn't us that sinned. No, it wasn't. And it never has been. The Rizal are guilty of naught but wanting the same freedom as others. You have been deceived by the Goddess's lies. If my strength of conviction is not plain enough through words, then let my actions speak for me! Heretics to the very last! Show them the full measure of the Goddess's wrath! By the goddess, I shall not let heretics defile her sacred land. At my back, today we purge the sickness from our home. Your cruelty has left the Roselle beaten and battered, bereft of the will even to anger at the injustice being done to them. However, today I will remind them. I will remind them they are worthy of more and reignite the courage within their hearts. Fight with me, friends! We march under the banner of freedom! Shall we? Shall I? Time to take flight! Leave everything to me! I will crush you!
let me show you what I've learned. Cool heads shall prevail. Victory goes to the twist. Just what I needed. I shall repay you in So, it falls to me. Give it a try. I leave no survivors. Prepare yourself. Shall. Now it's my turn. Now then, to work. I fight for peace. Here I come. Lend me your wings, Kluge! Face me if you dare. I do not leave survivors. Cool heads shall prevail. Allow me clever move. But with this terrain, I should... I leave no survivors. Now then. So, it falls to me. Free! Feisty, aren't we? Let me show you what I've learned. Always consequences. Here I come. This is now. Where to next? Face me if you dare. Give it a try. Now then. Cool heads shall prevail. Be at ease. Good. Shall we? Then. Get out of well, that worked. I'm old, not a pushover. I fight for peace. So it falls to me. A cold wind blows. Ready or not, here I come. Here I come. This is now. 
Prepare yourself. But with this terrain, I should... Let the very land of North Delia grant me might! Woohoo! Look at me go! I leave no survivors. I will crush you! I shall do what I can. Your wounds are your life saving. I fight for peace. The fires roar. We will make our ideals reality. I leave no survivors. Leave everything to me. Well, that worked. Where was I? Prepare yourself. You won't fool me. The battle is ours. Try this. I will crush you. There are always consequences. Let me show you what I've learned. Flames, heed my call! Let me heal your wounds. All better. Now then. I'll do my best! Leave everything to me. Ain't over yet! You saved the day. Well, congratulations are in order. Now then, to work. I leave no survivors. The hunt is on. I will crush you! You'll be nothing but a blood stain upon my blade! Let me show you what I've learned. But with this terrain, I should... I, Kamzel Ferret, shall carry out her justice in her stead. Purge the heretics from our land. There. <laughs> Allow me.
Let me heal your wounds. Victory goes to the quick. Now then, to work. on. Leave everything to me. Not bad. You'll be nothing but a blood stain upon my blade. I will end this. Shall I? You will not strike me. Where to next? I have to turn this around. Water, I beseech thee! So, it falls to me. This is everything I've got! Let me heal your wounds. For one and all. Clever move. The hunt is on. Another step! Feisty, aren't we? Shall we? <laughs> I fight for peace. Do you intend to follow your mother to her grave? Perhaps your fate was decided long before you were born. No. I intend to realize the future she could not. The Rizal shall be free! Free? You speak as if they were held here by force. They are here by the grace of divine will to answer for their sins. Listen, they want to be here. They want to cleanse their souls. Face me if you dare. Misfortune has brought you to me. Prepare yourself. Let the show begin! I leave no survivors. <laughs> Where was I? I shall do what I can. Allow me. Thank you so much. Come on, then. What are you and your Love cups you. about? All right, here I go. Here you go. The hunt is on. Darkness engulfs you. Allow me. Ah! I will crush you. Allow me. I 
I leave, no survivor. Wouldn't mind a potion. I see through you. My research bears fruit. Ah, goddess, give me strength to smite thine enemies. This isn't good. Clever move. Leave everything to me. Ah! Ah! Here I come. Prepare yourself. You will not strike me. Face me if you dare. Let me put you out of your misery. She'll do what I can. Allow me. Most appreciated. This battle is ours. Try this. Bit of a bind, this. Let me show you what I've learned. Now then. I, I don't pull my punches. My turn. You were no match for me. See now. So it falls to me. I shall do what I can. Be at ease. Much appreciated. I fight for peace. The hunt 
Armor's on. Yeah. Leave everything to me. Allow me. You will my fist struck true. Let me give it a try. Woohoo! Look at me go! Time for some research. Ow! I fight for peace. They brought a saint to his knees. And in our name, have we won? Is freedom at hand? But the goddess... Our sins will never be cleansed if we leave. We'll forever bear the brand of thieves. There are no sins to answer for. There never were. They were lies, just as the rest of the goddess's teachings. I've read the legends put to parchment by my mother. The Roselle never sought to hoard the salt for their own. No. They meant to use it for the good of one and all. They meant to share the salt crystals with every nation. It was Hyzant who sought to hide the crystals from the world. It is they who bear the sin of greed. I've heard this story before. From Lady Orlea's lips. But it's just a legend, isn't it? A legend doesn't prove her teachings false. Not without proof, leastways. There is proof. It's been here this entire time. Ready the explosives. We must destroy the statue. All set here, my lady. Just give the word. Look well, my people. Behold the truth of the teaching's deception. Behold the lies of the goddess. The statue! What? What is that? There's something inside. What is that? A pillar? It's a salt crystal. A huge one. Now do you see? Our forebears brought this bounty from the Earth to share it with the world. This is the salt pillar from the legend. To all the peoples of Norselia, we bequeath a great pillar of salt. It's just as our ancestors said, carved right here into the crystal. This crystal was meant to be a boon to all. But Hysand stole it and hid it away. They blamed us for their greed. All this time we've been paying for the sins of another. The so-called truths of the church were naught but twisted versions of reality. Just so. This statue was as hollow as the goddess herself, not but a pretty facade to hide an unspeakable sin. A sin that Hyzant must now answer for. A sin that the Hierophant must reconcile. What is the meaning of this? 
The statue! What have you done? The heretics desecrate our holy land! Heathens! We will pay for this. Kill them all! No! They come in numbers, my lady. We'll be surrounded before long. We've come too far to submit now. I won't leave my people behind. Lady Frederica fought for us, and now we must fight for her! She aims to free us. But now, we must free ourselves. Let's walk out of here, hand in hand. To arms, everyone! Pick up what you can find! Today we bid farewell to the Source! Aye! My lord, the North Gate is under attack! Our soldiers cannot hold it! They ask for reinforcements at once! What? What banner does our foe fly? No banner, my lord. It's an army of Roselle. At their head is a youth named Jerome. He's spouting heresy, claiming he'll free his brethren from their bonds. He came. Jerome is here. Fortune smiles upon us, my lady. Where they once surrounded us, now they are beset on all sides. We have an opportunity. Everyone, to the North Gate. We will join with Jerome and escape the capital. Aye! Protect me! 